Three, two, but now one, they're going up against five, a dialed in seasoned competitor in Brandon Bennett Young and his apex predator known as Vorion. You exchanges without a true winner from these, kind of feeling each other out. Those are very even. Now, guys, the way this is going to work in theory is that Vorion is going to try and play the ground game, get under Beast, and be able to win those weapon exchanges simply because it is under the other robot. So far, though, that is not happening. Well, you see the fork on the right side of Vorion there is, uh, it seems to be lodged upwards. I don't know if it got bent out of shape, but that is not going to help them with those ground game engagements. No, every benefit that having that fork was giving before, it is doing the opposite now. Still, Vorion getting a lot of contact. You see a lot of sparks flying. I don't see any uh -oh. movement from Beast now. No, that was a, a series of hits that didn't look super impressive from the outside, but you got to imagine each one doing just a little bit of damage on the inside of Beast. And that accumulative damage is on top of all day he's been receiving damage from these fights. Yeah, so these robots down. have taken a pounding. Yeah, keep in mind, Brandon had a bye at the beginning of the day. He's been sitting around for literally half the day waiting. Yeah, I talked to him earlier, and he, he seemed a, a little bored. He kind of had the same face he has on right now.